Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today I wanted to share with you guys one of the most anticipated tweaks for the iOS 8 jailbreak, OXO3. All right, and to start off, I wanted to say Merry Christmas to all of you who celebrated and happy holidays to those of you who don't. And thank you guys so much for watching my videos throughout 2014. I can't thank you enough for your incredible support. And also just ensure that you watch this video on the desktop version of YouTube as there will be numerous annotations on the screen now to kind of guide you and assist you beyond what I'm going to detail in today's video. And you can also find my top free Cydia tweaks video on my channel. Just be sure to check that out if you missed it yesterday and you'll obviously need to be jailbroken just again check out my channel for complete tutorials for every iteration of iOS 8 and with that said let's go ahead and get straight into it so OXO 3 is a revised version of the previous iterations of OXO it's an incredible multitasking tweak and let me show you what it does before we actually go into the settings so normally when you'd swipe up you know you get control center well now when you swipe up you get a combination of control center as well as multitasking so I have my toggles down below here at the bottom I I obviously have my music controls in the middle as well as the brightness slider over here on the left and volume on the right. This is fully customizable, but the coolest part again is that these two are now merged into one elegant interface and it looks absolutely incredible. So let's say I'm actually inside of an app here. Let's just go to YouTube. I can also swipe up from the left hand corner and it enters this really awesome view to where I have all of the apps that I have open in the background represented in small icons icons in the bottom and I can kind of just drag between them and release on the app that I want to open. So let's say I want to open up Cydia. Let's just go ahead and release and it brings me straight to Cydia. And this is actually the OXO3 listing. It's just available on the default Big Boss repository so you don't have to add anything. It is actually a premium package available inside of Cydia for $2.99 but for anyone who purchased the previous iteration of OXO being OXO2, you can buy it for simply $0.99. Cents. And that's what I did because I previously purchased OXO2. So now let's go ahead and swipe over to the settings app through OXO using its interface and we'll go over some of the features. So inside of settings, once you have OXO3 installed, like most tweaks, you'll receive a new settings pane for it. From there, you just have the option to toggle multi-center, which is the combination of control center and multitasking. You can also enable quick switcher, which is really great, and hot corners, which is how you're able to actually access quick switcher just by swiping up here over on the left-hand side. And if I wanted to, I could also kind of swipe up on the right to close out of the current application and kind of emulate the home button. You can also reverse those two, so it's the opposite inside of the advanced options portion. From here, you have the reachability display setting, which is actually new. I really like it because for me, this is an iPhone 6. It would be kind of hard to access the toggles, which would normally be on the top, like with the previous iteration of OXO, OXO 2. So now with reachability display, it kind of just merges it all down toward the bottom. And then you can easily access the apps that are open just by swiping between them. And then you have a few more options. I'm not really going to go over absolutely everything, but I am going to highlight a few things that I do like. So going through here inside of the slider action setting, I have it set so that when and inside of the multi-center view, when you tap on the brightness icon, it just puts it down to the minimum brightness. And then when you tap again, it reverts to the previous setting. And over on the right-hand side, when you tap on the volume control, it switches it to the ringer volume. Again, two different things. So now we're inside of ringer volume and now we're in overall volume. So let's go ahead and go back here and we'll actually go back out. You also have some different options for your album artwork and you can control how many of the applications it actually shows in side of the quick switcher. Otherwise, it will simply show six of the recent apps. But as you can see, just scrolling through here, I can go all the way to the end for every app that I have open inside of the background or my recent apps if they're not currently open. And then finally, like I was talking about previously, toward the bottom, we have the option to invert the hot corners. So that way, if you were to swipe up over on the left-hand side, it would actually exit out, and the right-hand side goes inside of that quick switcher view. But I'm going to just leave it at default. That's what I recommend. 
but if you wanted to, you could definitely invert it and you could switch up those two. So that's OXO3, guys. Again, a really quick look at it. I'm definitely super excited for the tweak. I plan on using it all of the time. It's absolutely great. I really enjoyed OXO2, and I think you guys will like it too. Again, it's one of the most anticipated tweaks for iOS 8. I hope you guys have an awesome Christmas. Again, if you celebrate it, and if not, whatever you celebrate, just ensure that you have a great time this holiday season. And if you guys like this tweak, as well as my previous top free City of Tweaks list, just be sure to rate this video up and leave a relevant comment down below in the comment section. Also, I am planning on holding a new giveaway more toward the end of this year. So just be sure to stick around for that and you can also leave some suggestions as to what I give away down below in the comments. Just leave your thoughts there, let me know what you guys think about OXO3, and if you want to be updated more often such as when I release new videos covering various things like jailbreak related topics or even the forthcoming Apple Watch, just be sure to like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. Again guys, have an absolutely awesome time and until next time, this is ICU, signing out.